Hello there guys and welcome back. So, I've had, I've had a bit of a think and I'm thinking, well, why do I need a gun for? And, well, the main thing I probably would need a gun for is possibly if I was to be uh, basically fucked by a group of zombies. And that's probably just about it, really. Um, so, I'm thinking about taking the USP... Since it's a quite an high caliber round, unfortunately the vehicle's quite big, which I can't really do anything about that really. I mean, is there anything else really worth? Ta no, I don't think anything else is really worth taking. <clears throat> I don't know. I know there's some uh, four or five rounds in this lot somewhere. So if I take a few four or fives, I've got to find the damn things first. Okay, so we've got one there. We got a two there. We haven't had, there isn't actually a lot, is that? Wow. Okay, I thought there was more than that. Maybe I uh, fluffed that up a little bit. Okay. That's weird. Ah, there we go. Okay. So it's not a lot. We don't really need a lot of ammo anyway. You know, just enough to get by. <coughs> so what I'm going to be doing now is I'm actually going to drop the crossbow. Now, I've been thinking about it, this area, this neighbourhood, is pretty safe. We haven't actually come across any zombies yet. So I'm thinking about maybe having a base uh, around this area. Possibly. Not necessarily, but possibly. After all, it is quite a big... Uh, oh, oops. Ah, we can actually see here that there might be some other stuff here. There's an evac shelter there. Oh, these are evac shelters. Oh, okay, whatever. So, yeah, I need to, I was going to put an out on here, and I think I still might, hang on, oh, there's, all, there's automatically an out here, right there. hang on there, <clears throat> edit an out, so I need to put good nut, as well as crossbow, just in case, so there we go, not only that, that's going to weigh a lot less now, because of, um, I'm not carrying bolts and a crossbow, so that's cool. I'm going to just reload that with... Just use the weakest ammo for the time being. The weakest apparently is FMJ. Because of the arm pierce. Um, <clears throat> I'm just going to... I'm just going to load it with... I'm just going to load it with ACP for the time being. There we go. And we're going to take it off. I'm only going to use it when necessary. Don't forget it is the load. And I don't actually have a suppressor for it. So yeah, that's cool. Now... There's quite a lot of stuff here still. There's a clothing store there. That would be even that would actually be really tempting to go in there, just to check see if there's a military rucksack rather than a normal backpack. Um, <clears throat> what else is that? We have a lot of pawn shops here. That's interesting. Now um, nothing to ram it into though, which is unfortunate. There's a lot of parks. That's meh. Really want to get down to that pharmacy and library though. <clears throat> but for the time being, we're okay. So, you know. That's good. That's good. Uh, cargo pants, apparently... Uh, when did I... Where? I could have sworn those was reinforced. There we go. Odd. Okay. So, off we go. On an adventure. To see what we can find. A nail gun. Ooh. <laughs> uh, that's also actually very tempting because I have actually got nails. Not a lot of them, but no. I actually had a lot of fun. Um, a couple of days back, I started a character. and there, I started a range character. And there was just not nothing at all. At all for ranged uh, in, in where I started. Apart from a nail gun that a zombie dropped. And I thought, well, fuck it. So what I did is I got the nail gun and I chopped down most of these. Uh, can you see these? Fe oh, God. Yeah, these fences here. Yeah, I basically just smashed these down and these are, these always give nails. So I gathered a shitload of nails and I just went pew pew and go all over the place. Funny thing is, is that... Oh, there's a zombie there. Funny thing about that is that it's pretty... It's put the the nail gun is actually really down quick. You can you can probably get out three or four shots off before that before the zombies have a chance to move. 
And once your once your level is up quite high, your uh, firearms level, it does quite strange, intense damage. It's really weird. You know, it kind of it really works. I should probably try that one of the days and uh, show you guys that. But yeah, it was really weird how eh? well it worked. Of course, I don't, I don't some stupid. Can't remember what I died to, but uh, I do remember dying. I think it might have been to uh, to Hulk actually. Yeah, the, uh, apparently now's aren't very good on orcs. Yeah, who would have thought? <laughs> but yeah, I, I found that really, uh, really intriguing. Now I just remembered something. I've still got my flashlight on. Oh, I need to take it off. <clears throat> Let's just take that off. Oh, I'm gone. No, activate it. I also still have that really massive axe, don't I? Yeah. I think I'm gonna just drop that. I'm gonna drop that in the gun um, house, I think. Gun nuts house. I'm just gonna drop it right here. There we go. Okay. What time is it now? It's eight. It's ten past eight. That is really early, and we've got rid of our we've we've got rid of our symptoms. Wow! If I knew it was that easy to get rid of uh, smoking, I oh fuck! I probably would have uh, I probably would have done it a bit sooner on my uh, on my first character in this particular uh, update. But that's cool. That's cool. We are really hitting the zombie pretty damn um, hard there. Doesn't look like we are, but we actually are. You know, considering our unarmed isn't that great yet, and considering that our dodge isn't that great yet either. You know, that's pretty cool. Uh, we've got batteries. Don't need batteries really. Don't need batteries at all yet. We haven't found a knot plate, and I think a knot plate would actually be too heavy for us to really carry around. Oh, what did I, what happened there? I didn't pick all of them. How did I mass pick all then? Oh, I want to know how to mass pick all. That was good, but I don't want them. <laughs> Hang on, let's try again. How did I, how did I, how did I mass pick all? That was weird. I don't know how that. No, I don't know. I must pick them. That's weird. We don't actually need apples. We just need uh, water, fluids. So let's take orange juice. Uh, let's take. Nah, let's just take that for the time being. There's actually quite a lot of food and um, water in there. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna put a note. I don't think. I don't think it's worth a note. Messenger bag. Encumbrance of zero. Oh, it does encumber the torso though. So let's just see how um, badly it actually encumbers the torso. Yeah, one. Yeah, not really that fussed with that then, really. Fuck it off. <clears throat> There's another cheap lighter there. There's a pair of scissors that we don't need. Eyeglasses. A suit. Hoodie. Hoodie that fits. Cargo pants that fit. We've already got cargo pants. Uh, I think we've already got cargo pants. We have, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, we have got cargo pants. And cargo shorts. Nah, I don't need none of that crap. Uh, really, it's just trying to find um, health items now, like, fi uh, like first aids and stuff like that. Vitamins. We'll take the heat pack. There we go. Do you know how many e-packs I've got now? And do these actually encumber? I think these encumber as well, don't they? Yeah, there's one weight and one encumbrance. <clears throat> so yeah, I don't know. I still don't know if you can actually warm yourself up with them. I mean, I did. Like I said, like I said um, a couple of episodes ago, I did try it and it didn't work. I don't know if there's a special way to apply them or whatnot, but I pretty much tried what I could, and there's just no luck. So. Unless there's a very, very special way of doing it that I have no idea about. Then uh, it doesn't seem like you can use it to warm yourself up. Which is unfortunate. It really is. Haha, hello. Vitamins, that's been night quill. Oh, I need to take my vitamins for the day. I forgot about that. Wow, look how many vitamins we've got now. Jesus Christ. That's a lot of vitamins. That'll last us a good few months. Jesus. <clears throat> I 
I must say we are handling our encumbrance a lot uh, better in this one. What the fuck am I doing? Yeah, we're handling our volume encumbrance a lot better in this one. In fact, our weight hasn't even exceeded 100 yet. We've got pretty much everything we need as well. Just obviously we haven't got a knock plate, uh, which is unfortunate. Most other stuff we've got, we've got we've got three different types of different kind of painkillers. Uh, still got books to read. Still got string. Don't really need that string now. So, you know, I could, I could probably get rid of that string. There is an MP3 player there. That might be worthwhile going, actually. Just to get, it, to get my morale up a little bit. Uh, what else? So we've got Siggy's backpack. Another BB gun, but with no pellets. So it's pointless. And nothing in there. Brilliant. I don't know what else we're actually looking for at the moment. Um, I think I just want to start maybe getting some fights and getting my unarmed up. That seems like a reasonable idea. There's a gas station there. Ooh, there's sound coming from this particular house. Let's clean up the glass. Heard a wump? Yes. No, no, no. Oh, shit. Zombie hit my torso. Okay. Right, so that zombie it didn't take very long to actually come out and kill me. The other one is... Come on. Come and get me, you bastard. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I think that pain resistant was definitely a pretty damn decent perk to get. I mean, at the end of the day, you don't want to be hooked on, um, on painkillers because, you know... There's only a set amount. I mean, you can make puppy painkillers, which we might... I don't know if we're going to end up doing. We could do. You know, that's a possibility. But at the end of the day, I don't really want to. We if can help it. Because we've still got plenty of aspirin. And that should suffice for the time being. There's a wolf here. <coughs> Wolves are a bit more harder than... Uh, uh, elf ways than cougars. I'm debating whether to get the USP out on this one. I might just risk it and just... Get the wolf. I've got in two attacks. Well, I missed the second one, unfortunately, and I did get hit on my arm. Um, okay, let's just get the USP out for this one. Um, perhaps even increase my firearms a little bit. There we go. It's all I needed. Quickly reload, and just go back to my karate. There we go. I can even butcher. And I destroy the meat. Let's continue working. There is a zombie in the other room. Clearly. You start scratching yourself all over. Is that my skits kicking in? Finally. Ah, I knew it was too good to be true. Skits hasn't played up at all. Uh, during this particular uh, playthrough. And now it has. Great. Well, let's eat the cooked meat. Nom nom nom. I'm still not full. Let's eat that apple. And we'll drink the orange juice. There we go. Just realised I haven't done another sound check for this one yet, so I hope I hope you can bloody hear me. Christ, that'll be that'll be uh that'll be a pain in the ass if you if you aren't hearing me. Christ. Yeah, easily. Easily overcome him. I wonder where my dodge is now. Dodge is at two. Doesn't seem to be going up very high. Um, very quickly, which is really unusual. I've got bugs in the skin and a slight bit of pain. Hmm. Okay. Bandana. Uh, a sewing kit. Aha. Sewing kit can be unloaded and dropped. Uh, I might even have to do a quick bit of um oh no none of none of stuff have been ripped yet. That's good. It's actually really handy. Hmm. I wonder if there's gonna ever be uh, another sort of sewing kit for other materials because from what I remember you can't actually um you can't repair sneakers, am I right? Yeah, it's not made of cotton or wool. Maybe um, you get a different sort of repair kit to repair those kinds of um, materials. I don't know what kind of material the sneakers would use, but you know, you know what I mean. 
be kind of cool if we could. That would mean more encumbrance. You'd have to obviously uh, carry more stuff to be able to repair that kind of stuff as well. So yeah, you know, that'd be, that'd be pretty cool. Is there anything in uh, Is that just... If that's just... Oh, it's coding. Ooh. That is actually really tempting. There we go. Get the codeine. And antibiotics. We'll pick them up anyway. Because they don't weigh a thing. So, yeah. And we've got a few zombies. Brilliant. Come on, then. Let's start coiting. Yeah. Come on. Boof. 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 Oh shit, and I walked straight back into him. Stupid me. There we go. Yeah, these zombies don't really seem that troublesome in all honesty, but I can I, I can understand like if it was normal normal cataclysm zombies, then yeah, you would you would probably have a few problems with some of the uh, more special zombies. Uh, where you probably would actually need um some type of ranged weapon, like a gun. Uh Okay, that's cool. Zombie corpse and socks. We don't need food. Sunglasses, nope. Light jacket, nope. Uh, me trying to swallow with a sore throat, nope. Uh, okay, brilliant. So we've actually managed to pretty much discuss, yeah we've pretty much covered this whole entire street here. That's that that's that's an accomplishment. That really is. Now PlayStation. What if it's worthwhile trying to break into this? Probably not. Oh, there's a zombie dog there. I missed that. Um, probably a decent idea to get the USB for this one. I don't want to be taking too much damage. There we go. Just reload that. And take off our USP. There we go. I uh, can't go in there. That's fine. And you just hear me breathing. Turn the mic. Ah, uh, there we go. A pot and a sewing kit. Where's my sewing kit gone? Oh, it's it's under it's under a different thing there. Brilliant. So can we drop it now? Yep, we can. And we're doing. We seem to be doing fine. We've got plenty of stuff now. We've got plenty of food that we might be able to cook. We don't have a pot. I think I'm actually considering picking that pot up. Do you know what I think I'm going to? Uh, if the game wasn't freezing every two seconds. Uh oh. Oh. I have no idea what happened there. It just froze. Weird. Yeah, we're going to pick that pot up. Um. Yeah, might as might as well, aren't we? Oh, I'm, I'm having some frame issues. Wow, that's really damn unusual. That's usually a sign. Oh, you know what it is it's because I pressed number lock. <laughs> Oops. Number lock is the death of many roguelikes, as well as caps lock. Would you believe? Okay, so it's now 20 past 10 in the morning. We've managed to get an awful lot of stuff done, actually. Even though it looks like we haven't. We actually have. We've cleared out this particular area pretty much completely. It's now a case of checking some of the more special buildings, such as oh yeah, the restaurant and clothing store. Uh, we'll definitely check the clothing store. There is a zombie to the south of there. There's a lot of zombies here. Okay. Quite in time. Let's go towards this one first. A bit more. There we go. Wait for it to come to me. Then quite. Yeah, that extra dodge that you get from karate when you actually uh, get a hit in. That is, that is really beneficial. Really is. Just allows you to dodge straight away, which is really nice. And then of course, if you get um, attacked again during the same turn, then uh, you get your blocks as well. Sometimes you don't block, though. I've noticed. Otherwise, mines would be a lot more fucked than that. So it's, it's interesting. Whoa, there's a lot of uh, stuff here. To be quite fair, that I probably don't need most of this. So 
much. It's a case of going through one by one and seeing what I actually need. As I said, I probably don't need many. I probably not even need any of this. Uh, military backpack is something I was looking at straight away, but there's nothing here. There's only a few. There's only a backpack, in fact. Um, a few things fit. Uh, let's have a look at our stuff. Right, so our arms and torso. Now, technically they're not 20. They're actually 50 because I put my hoodie on when I get cold. So, f legs are 20. Now, legs, I can actually sort that out myself, I believe, with... Um, Oh, I can't. I can't build them yet. I can't build them. I can't craft them yet. So we might. We might actually find something useful here. We need a. Oh, what they're called. Well, they haven't got them in here anyway. I know what they're called. I know what they're called, but I don't know what they're called. Um, lung underwear. That's it. We need lung underwear. And unfortunately, there's none in that clothes store. So. Well, that would have been probably really great uh, right at the start of the game. It's completely useless now. And unless, of course, um, something gets ripped and shredded and fucked. But, man, uh, we're okay. We are okay. And there's a lot of zombies here. Um, is this the time where we go into a house? And, yeah, I think I think it is that time. Come on, then. Get your ass through this window. Come on. I want to see you break this window. There you go. Right. That's some of this shit bastard. This is probably a good time where that uh, axe would have come into play, actually. But sod it. Wow. Just completely mopped those up. That was amazing. There's ammo there. Armor piercing's 30, Jesus Christ, what kind of amount? It's the 5.7 ammo. Ah. Now I might actually pick that up. For a good couple of reasons. I'm just going to keep it on in my inventory for the time being. And then when we get back to that little gun nut place, we can um, just deposit it. Oh, there's a zombie there, hello. Didn't see you. Oh, you hit me then, bastard. Oh, the bite wound feels really deep. Oh no. Okay. So, yeah, we've got a bite wound, so we need to uh, cauterize that. Uh, where is my butcher knife? Oh, yeah, the butcher knife. Jesus, this is going to hurt. Yeah. Hurts like hell, but there's no pain. Um, is that a bug? Is that a bug, developers? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I would have thought you'd have uh, acquired some pain from that. Maybe it's because I've got pain resistance. Oh, I'm not 100% sure. I might ask him in chatting a bit later to see if, uh, see if that's the case. Wow, we're taking a bit of damage here. What the fuck's going on? We should be at least dodging some of this. There we go. It's a sledgehammer. Oh my god. Isn't that tempting? There we go. That would be damn tempting to smash that police sledgehammer. What's it got? Oh, it's fought to bash, knockback attack, and it's all adjacent monsters. Do you know what? I think I think uh, we might try that one of these. We'll try and make a sledgehammer character. Jesus. I can imagine the uh, the trolls, the shits, and the giggles on that one. <clears throat> but for now, we'll keep with happy... What is his name? Brandon Briant. Brandon Brilliant. Hmm. Good name. What is this store? It's a house, not a store. Looks like it looks like a store. <clears throat> That's a lot of zombies. I'm going to a window. <laughs> a zombie cop up to the west. Well I can't see it unfortunately because of uh I don't know why actually. Just couldn't see it. Okay, so we'll use the same tactic again. We'll wait for them to come through here. Oh dear, all of them lost sight of me apart from one. That's terrible. That's just terrible. That's terrible. Is there anything new? Nope. Okay. But on the other hand, we can just um, wait for them to come to us now, one at a time. Or to do it two at a time. You know. Oh, matey. 
Come on. There we go. What we've got here? Lighter. Brilliant. More zombies. So the great thing about static spawning is this. Oh shit, and I just took some damage trying to talk to you. Jesus. Okay. I am taking some hefty damage to the torso here, and I shouldn't be. I wonder if I put the right thing. I wonder if this is the one that actually blocks with the arms. It might not be, you know. I never thought of that. How do I get information on it now? I need to... What have I got? What have I got to pause as a weapon? No, I don't pot as a weapon. Maybe that was why, because I'm using the pot as a weapon. Oh, I think it might have been. Shit. Well, that explains a lot. That explains why I wasn't dodging. Bollocks. Yeah, I need to bandage myself up now as well. I should have, I should have, I should have, that was my own fault. I should have really checked that myself. Uh, I've just, I've just healed the wrong, wrong bloody part as well. Let's get me torso back up to green. Oh, where's this bear? To the east, okay. So yeah, that kind of explains why I wasn't dodging. It explains why I was getting horribly murdered. Yeah. Wow, criticals are doing quite a lot of damage now. Oh, it seems to be critting quite a lot. There we go. Brilliant. It's not out of the woods yet, though. We've still got a few zombies even there. And we've got that zombie cop that we're gonna have to, probably going to have to use the 4 5 on. There we go. All I can say is this. Thank God this isn't first person. Because I would have died ages ago. <laughs> yeah, forget about agreeing. You're not supposed to agree with me. That's not your job. <laughs> uh, I, can hear, I can hear you saying, yeah, yeah, you're, you're ambitious to the... You're ambitious to first person games, are you? Uh, shh. Right, so that was terrible. I, I don't even know why I butchered the corpse there. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why I just butchered the corpse. It's too funny. Right, okay. Let's uh, kite. Okay, we seem to be losing a bit of speed here, and I'm trying to figure out why. It's the pain we're in. It's not really surprising, actually, considering. There we go. I have no idea why that zombie was just standing there, but hey, I'm not going to complain. If the zombie wants to stand there, it can stand there. Fuck off, there we go. Yeah, you block with your left arm, so it is the arms, the karate is. I thought it was. It wasn't really showing that very well, though, was it? That was a crowbar there. Oh, fuck it, don't eat it. Don't eat it now. Okay, there's a few more zombies coming this way. I need to check see if I need to cauterize anything actually because I have been hit a few times. So uh let's let me get to me not lighter, me butcher knife. Do I need to? No, I'm not bleeding or bitten. There is no need to cauterize yourself. Don't know if I'm pronouncing that right either, you know. Pronunciations and me aren't a thing, if you haven't already guessed. Do I care? Not one bit. Not one bit. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh wow, I got it then. No, I don't think that went deep enough for the look of it. Yeah, I think I think it says when it goes too deep. I'm presuming it is anyway, but we can check. No, it's fine. So it's when you get um badly bitten. Wow our legs taking a bit of punishment now as well. It's not good. Yeah, we're actually in quite a lot of pain here. I didn't realise that at the time, but we are in a lot of pain, which is probably the reason why we are actually getting caught out here. So, uh, a book was... Oh. It's actually got quite an interesting uh, fashion cut. Well, okay. Odd. Right, we're going to take some painkillers. I think I'm just going to take normal aspirin for the time being. Uh, a pair of aspirin should um, suffice. Should suffice. Uh, what else have we got here? We've got a bank, we've got a pawn shop, and a hardware store. Hardware store would definitely be a nice find, especially if we can find a hot plate. 
do you know what? I'm actually getting, I'm getting to, I was getting to more pain then rather than um, losing it, which is weird. I'm going to uh, actually eat a couple of things here. Just make sure I'm all right before I get completely... Um, there we go. And I'm happy as well. So that's always good. I think after I've uh, killed these zombies, I'm going to stop going on arm for a bit because my experience has probably been that low for quite some time now and I just won't be gaining the experience that I really want to so after this I'll probably start reading a few books I do have a few books to read so that's cool come on there we go hey aspirin I'll always take extra aspirin Is there anything else? There are many items here. Oh yeah, that's the other bulk cutters was. Okay, I'm just gonna um I don't think the zombies actually see me, so I'm not really too fussed about it. I'm just gonna go back now and I think I'm gonna go to the gun nuts place and make that my little home. Oh shit, where's this zombie come from? That shit me up. That actually really did shit me up. I don't know where it come from. I just got bitten again. Jesus. Not good. Right, where is uh, I think it's here, isn't it? Door's locked. Wait, what? Is this the right... Where's the house? Where's the house? Oh, it's up there. Okay. That makes more sense, I suppose. I, I haven't been in this house then, have I, by the look of it? No, I haven't. Shit, I need to check this house. Let's check this house first. Oh, there we go. Fred. Guess, please. Might need to do some repairing now. Ooh, aspirin. Ooh, aspirin. <laughs> uh, plastic bottle of salt, plastic bottle, heat pack, dust mask. Yeah, that's it, that'll do. Drink from the bathtub, num num num. Tastes really nice. Sure it does. And that looks like it's pretty much it. Ha, ah, books. <clears throat> uh, no, nothing I want, really. Not really bothered about that. Oh, a cheap light like <coughs> Ah, sorry. Before I was getting to the stage where uh, doesn't want me to speak anymore, which is not very pleasant. Okay. Yeah, I think I think we can uh, live here for a little bit. Why not? Doesn't seem like a bad idea. Just shut that door. Yeah. Okay. Brilliant. Apparently, we see a cheap lighter. Oh, brilliant. There's a cheap light on the bed. That was Andy. <laughs> right, so it's just a case of, I suppose, reading books. We don't even need to uh, do any sewing. That's cool. That's cool. Okay, reading books time then. So I'm going to pause it here and uh, I'll see you in two tick. Actually, oh, we're on 35 minutes already. Shit. Okay, um, I'll see you for the next one then, I guess.